morning I'm going to show you how to update our new V light. It's an important update that's just come out, which is long over well, I've been waiting for it anyway. So I've got my mouse plugged in so I don't have to keep on reaching in front of the screen, but it's the same thing, just hit the GROM symbol. Make sure Bluetooth tethering is ticked. Go to the support page and go down to update V line. So we're on 17, that is the software version. 72 is the firmware version. Can you see them? Okay, check for updates. Look, it says 18 is available. It's only 4.8 megabytes, but my signal here is dreadful. I'm going to pause it while it's downloading. Okay, welcome back. Okay, so now we're going to hit the install. Pause it again. I'll just wait until it comes up what we're loading. So no one might pause it now. Alright, I'm back again. And our version numbers are just about to come up, I guess. So you won't lose any of the settings. Nothing will really change except for some of the menus you used to navigate to you couldn't get out of. Now we don't really need those menus, so they've deleted them. And the ones you do need, there's a new scroll bar on them, which is very, very handy. Right, I don't know if you can see that. It's 18, and that's still on 72. So bear with it. And now I'm going to go into all the settings here before CarPlay steals it away. Down the bottom here, it's all settings. You'll see new scroll bars on here. This is new, where they didn't have them before. You couldn't get out of them, there wasn't this back button. So yeah, this has made all the difference. Play. Lovely.